On behalf of Apex Electronics, its partners, and employees, I would like to thank you for your purchase of the Apex Type A TDCS system. We work very hard to make the Apex Type A right here in the United States. And the reason we go through the trouble of hand making and testing every single Apex in-house is the fact that we truly believe our product offers the features a person like you should have when using TDCS while keeping the price down. In this video, we are covering the initial steps from opening the box and inspecting your device, setting it up and testing it. So let's get started. Just a quick observation about the packaging. When you get your Apex from any retailer, it'll come packed with all the accessories you need to get started. The only items you need to add to the kit are the two nine volt batteries and the saline solution. Lithium batteries and rechargeable batteries should never be used as they operate at a different voltage and are not good for TDCS purposes. Once you remove the items and accessories from the protective bubble bag, you should have the following. One Apex Type A 18 volts, one pair of ElectroSquare electrodes and cables, a pair of electrode positioning headbands, one for each electrode, the headbands can be used to hold the electrodes to the arm or neck as well. Check out our tutorial on how to choose and set your desired montage. Once you have everything out, notice this red label over the meter right here. This is very important. We'll come back to this in just a few seconds. Leave that alone for now. Go ahead and turn the device around to install brand new batteries out of the package. Installing the batteries into the device is a very easy task, as you can see here. Simply match the battery connector shape to the counterpart on the device battery clip. Snap them together, this may require some force, and then place the cable slack into the case as such. Then snap the compartment closed and you are all set. Now you can turn your device around again and turn it on. Confirm the light on the device is on. You can remove that plastic cover from the meter and notice that the meter does not move at all. Go ahead, turn the knob all the way up. See, no change on the meter. That is by design. As the meter measures current flow, and at this time, there is no electrons flowing out of the device because it is not connected to anything, the meter is totally inactive. Now go ahead and get one of the electrosquare cables you have received with your device. Insert one of the provided cables into both connectors and turn the knob up again. You immediately see a reaction on the meter. When you have the electrodes wet with saline, connected to the cables and have them placed where desired, the electrons will flow from one connector to the other through you. That is why it is called transcranial direct current stimulation. The integrated meter will allow you to constantly monitor the electric flow in real time with zero latency. This ensures you always know your Apex CDCS system is delivering the exact amount of current you need. No more, no less. If you had issues reaching top stimulation levels, or you had any other problems during this step, you should check out our troubleshooting section. We have videos that cover the most common issues with your device, from calibration problems, when the needle is not at zero, or other easy to fix problems you may encounter that can be resolved within minutes so you can be back on track for your first session. If you prefer, you can also just contact Apex Support. The phone number is 877-915-8327 or you can email us at contact at apexdevice.net. We will help you, sometimes within minutes. We will do whatever it takes for you to get your TDCS session started. You have a year warranty on your device and we take your satisfaction 
very seriously. Just see if there's a chance to troubleshoot the issue with you and we'll take any action necessary to resolve your problem. That is a promise. Once you perform this test and your device successfully reaches maximum stimulation levels, could be either two or four milliamps, depending on your model, you have now completed an essential step to ensure you have a functioning TDCS device and you are ready for the next step. We are going to get your Electrosquare Electros ready for your first session. See you there.